What is going on everybody? How's it going? Welcome back to the channel. So today I got a, a quick little small video from uh, picked up a little haul from Tractor Supply. One item for me, one item that my wife picked out while we were there. So please stick around, check out the video, and I'll see you guys there. Thank you for watching. What is up everybody? How's it going? And welcome back to the channel. So before we get started, please like, comment, subscribe, and smush the bell notification icon for future updates. And um, also, <clears throat> if you guys can uh, click the like button, that would be awesome. Um, so, <clears throat> I'm feeling a little scratchy in my throat, but apologize guys so picked up just two items I actually I actually had in my hand I had two of these tape measures because th this is actually the tape measure that I carry all the time it's just in a different color so this one it says self lock on the top it says self lock power blade number two magnetic tip uh, came along 25 foot it's an SL72425. This one's an SL72425T. So this one is, a, I, I'm guessing, maybe a little bit newer. Looks on the bottom exactly the same. Um, there is a slight difference, though. This one, the magnets are on the front of the blade. On the older style, the blade is flat. The magnet is up here. This is probably going to be way easier to get dirt and, and magnetic particles off of this tape measure compared to this one because you can see this one, it's not really easy to get rid of. It just slides on it on the side and then it gets stuck underneath everything. Um, but there is a downside. Um, this They're both Camelon. They're both magnetic tip. They're both Power Blade 2 self lock self lock 25 feet both of them say sl7 2425 but the yellow one has the t um there is one other difference between them um the design looks about the exact same you know this white the the over molding white over mold uh, yellow over molding um the exact same kick out on the back exact same bottom uh, the blade is actually the same so on the bottom of this one you have the the height style on this on the front this is one I use a lot it's got quarter one eighth quarter three eighths half inch five eighths three quarter it's got the increments on it but this one does not it does not have the cheater increments on it so the, the numbers on this one are a lot bigger than this one. Um, but they chose not to put the increments like this one. I've been looking for another one of this exact tape measure because this one I ended up messing it up when I got in my truck accident. I had two of these in my hand. They were uh, Tractor Supply only wanted $11 for them, which was not bad at all. I love the self lock. I wish Milwaukee had their stubby tape measures in this self-lock style where, you, where it locks when you pull it out. And then you have to push the button to get it to come in. I wish even I wish even DeWalt would do that. I have a DeWalt one sitting right here, which is the newer, it's the brand new DeWalt Tough Series. This is the 35 foot. They do have this in a 25 foot and they do have it in a 16 foot. This one, the magnet is removable though. So this one you can unclip and take the magnet off um, so that is nice so you can actually clean the magnet while it's off the tape measure and then you can crap sometimes it can be a pain slide it under this one pop it into place now I'm a fan of the self-lock because sometimes you're just really busy 
Um, and this gets annoying where you have to put your finger here on the blade to control the blade. And the further it gets out, the harder it is, in my opinion, to control. This one has the, you know, you have to push the lever, which this is tried and true that, you know, you push the lever to lock has always worked. It's been around for decades. Um, I do like that tape measure. I'm looking at getting the, the that, this tough series, DeWalt. I'm looking at getting the 25 in, uh, foot as well as they have, I think, a 16 foot. Um, I'm looking at picking those up. I have an obsession with, with measurement tools, including tape measures. When I saw this, I thought it was just a different color. It's not. It's actually does it it does have the exact same you know height style measurement on the back where the numbers are horizontal or going you know vertically up and down compared to this one it's going horizontally um, so that is the same they're both 25 footers I just was a little let down that uh, when I got home and I saw it uh, it didn't have the, the cheater increments, you know, one eighth, quarter, three eighths, half inch, five eighths, three quarters, seven eighths, because that, that helps a lot most of the time. But, um, you know, it's a tape measure. It will get use. Um, it is a Camelon. I like the Camelon brand. This still works. I actually took a hammer to it the other day and tried to flatten this blade out because the blade was completely bent. This tape measure was on my hip when the truck flipped. Um, it doesn't it doesn't self retract as fast as it used to anymore, but um, it's a lot straighter than it was. You can see it's still tweaked. Um, it's not as straight as I'd like it, but when I flipped when I flipped in the truck, it this was still on my hip. I was actually walking around looking for my phone. This was still on my hip, but my hip actually hit the console, um, the center console on the floor, and that I think is how it got damaged. Um, but I picked up another one of these, and then this little guy right here is something my wife, she, she followed me around the store, and hey, can I get this? Hey, can I get this? And I'm like, get what? Cause she didn't have it in her hand and like so i was walking around looking at you know what i wanted to look at i'm like okay well show me what you were looking at and it's like this little um wax melt warmer set you put little tea candles in this piece and then you actually put this cast iron uh, this is actually a cast iron little skillet or pan um, and you set this over the tea candle and you put wax in this and it will make the room smell good. Cast iron pan wax melt warmer set. Oops. I was using the other light. My bad. But um, one it comes with one wax warmer. One 2.75 ounce. 77.96 gram. Maple syrup and pancake wax melts. Um, she, I'm like, Are you sure? Um, you want you want to buy this? It was only it was only nine dollars ninety nine cents. This was only eleven. We didn't really spend much. Um, I just didn't find what else I was looking for at Tractor Supply. I wish I can find those guards. Um, at Tractor Supply, there's a couple Makita grinders that have a plastic shroud that clips onto the grinder guard, the actual guard. Um. I can't find those anywhere. I've I've looked uh, looked them up at one point, and what I found is that you can go to like Makita Japan's website and find them. I'm not sure where Tractor Supply got them for their displays. I even tried to buy them from Tractor Supply. They're like, I'm sorry, you can't sell it to you. It's on the display. I'm like, well, three of these grinders don't have it, and the other three do. I, I just want one or two of them. You know, can I give you guys like $15, $20 dollars a piece for them? No. I'm like, really? You guys are declining $20 for something? You could put it as miscellaneous or bolts or something. It doesn't matter. They told me no. So, um, but my wife wanted this. I told her, yeah, go ahead and grab it. It was $9.99. It's actually stamped on the back. Um, and we, it, it's these little wax cubes. And I have a bunch of these cubes in the house. 
and I've never really used them. Wasn't sure what they were for. They just happened to be in the house when I bought the house a long, long time ago. But, you know, it's an item my wife wanted. Um, I'm just putting it in the video so I can give it to her. Maybe she wants to make a video about it. I don't know. But um, I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome rest of your day. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. That is all I got for you guys today. Hope you guys have an, uh, a good rest of your day and uh, don't work too hard. As always, please like, comment, subscribe. Smoosh the bell notification icon for future updates. Go check out my Amazon affiliate links, my Acme Tools affiliate links, my DJI Electronics affiliate links, as well as my Ohio Power Tools affiliate links. You guys have an awesome, awesome rest of your day. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace!